<laughs> Hello, pet enthusiasts. Ever wondered if canned fish is good for your cat? Welcome to Superfood Channel for Animals. Today we're casting our nets into the sea of knowledge about canned fish. I'm Rob, an author with dozens of pet books under my belt, distributed across more than 25 countries. We'll be sinking our claws into whether canned fish is good or bad, the difference between oil or water packed, and which fish types are best. Stay tuned as we dive into the world of canned fish for our feline friends. Canned fish can be a healthy treat for cats, but moderation is key. Now let's delve into why. Fish is an excellent source of protein, an essential nutrient that helps your feline friend to maintain strong muscles and a healthy immune system. Additionally, fish is rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which are known to support heart health and promote a shiny coat. However, while fish does have its benefits, there are also potential pitfalls to be aware of when feeding your cat canned fish. One such concern is mercury. Some types of fish, notably tuna, can contain high levels of this heavy metal. Over time, if consumed in large quantities, mercury can be harmful to cats, causing a range of health problems. Another potential concern is the sodium content of canned fish. Cats, especially those with health conditions like kidney disease or hypertension, need to watch their sodium intake, even MPRE. Too much sodium can lead to health issues such as increased thirst, urination and even electrolyte imbalances. Moreover, canned fish may contain additives or seasonings that are not suitable for cats. These can include onions or garlic, which are toxic to cats, or certain types of oils, which can upset a cat's stomach. Always check the label for any such ingredients before feeding canned fish to your cat. Bones are another potential hazard. While canned fish is often boneless, small bones can sometimes find their way into the can. These can pose a choking hazard or cause intestinal injuries, so it's always best to check the fish carefully before feeding it to your cat. In conclusion, while canned fish can be a healthy treat for cats, it should be fed in moderation. The high protein and omega-3 content can benefit your cat, but the potential pitfalls of mercury, sodium, additives and bones mean it shouldn't be a staple of your cat's diet. So canned fish isn't off the menu, but it's not an everyday dish either. When it comes to canned fish for cats, water trumps oil, here's why. Oil-packed fish may seem like a luxury treat for your feline friend, but it carries a few hidden drawbacks. Firstly, these types of fish tend to be higher in fat. While cats need a certain amount of fat in their diet, too much can lead to obesity and other health issues such as pancreatitis. So it's important to keep an eye on the fat content in your cat's diet. Moreover, oil-packed fish often contain added oils or fats. These aren't necessary for cats and could potentially upset their stomachs. It's always best to keep your cat's diet as natural and simple as possible, and that means avoiding unnecessary additives. Another concern with oil-packed fish is the sodium content. While sodium is an essential mineral for cats, too much can be harmful. High sodium intake can lead to dehydration, high blood pressure and even kidney disease in cats. Therefore, it's best to opt for low sodium options. Now, let's talk about texture. Some cats might turn up their noses at the oily texture of oil-packed fish. On the other hand, water-packed fish usually have a texture that cats find more palatable. But what about water-packed fish? Well, they're a simpler, more natural option. They don't come with added oils or fats and they're typically lower in sodium. Plus, the texture is often a hit with our feline friends. Water-packed fish also tend to retain more of the fish's natural flavor, which can make them more appealing to cats. And let's not forget about the health benefits. Fish is a great source of protein and omega-3 fatty acids, which are essential for a cat's health. When packed in water, these nutrients are preserved better than they are in oil. So when you're scanning the shelves, reach for that can of fish packed in water. Your cat's health and taste buds will thank you. Choosing the right fish for your cat can feel like navigating a sea of options. Let's make it easier. First up, we have canned tuna. This popular choice is a good source of protein and omega-3 fatty acids. However, it's essential to feed it in moderation due to its potential mercury content. When you're shopping, look for cans labeled as light or skipjack. These varieties tend to have lower mercury levels. Next, let's dive into canned salmon. Salmon is a rich source of those beneficial omega-3 fatty acids. Not only do these help keep your cat's coat shiny, but they also support overall health. Just remember, while salmon is a great choice, it's not meant to replace a complete and balanced cat diet. 
Sardines, small but mighty, are another good option. Packed full of protein and omega-3s, they're a healthy treat your cat is sure to love. When choosing sardines, look for those packed in water without added salt or seasonings. This ensures your cat is getting the good stuff without any unnecessary extras. Last but not least, we have mackerel. This fish can be a tasty treat for your cat when fed in moderation. Similar to the others, look for varieties that are low in sodium and free from additives. Now, you may be wondering, why the emphasis on wild-caught fish? Well, wild-caught fish are generally considered to be more sustainable and have lower levels of pollutants compared to their farmed counterparts. Plus, they can provide a wider variety of nutrients, so when you're scanning those cans, keep an eye out for the wild-caught label. In conclusion, whether it's tuna, salmon, sardines or mackerel, each type of fish offers its unique benefits. But remember the golden rule, moderation is key. And always, always check the labels. Look out for any added salt, seasonings or other additives that could potentially upset your cat's stomach. Remember, the best choice is a well-informed one, so always check those labels. So there you have it, the lowdown on canned fish for cats. We've covered the pros and cons, the significance of water packed over oil packed and some feline friendly fish options. Remember, moderation is key and always check the label for any unnecessary additives. With the right choices, canned fish can be a healthy addition to your cat's diet. If you found this video helpful or interesting, hit that like button and subscribe for more. Your support helps us create more pet related content. If you found this video helpful or interesting, show some appreciation by hitting the like button and subscribing for more. This helps us a lot so we can make more informative videos about pets.